Takamoto and Katsuta on the podium in Lapland three years ago, a feat matched by another rising star at this year's event. Oliver Solberg finishing third in his Hyundai R5, a performance that very evidently turned a few heads. No sooner had the teenager gone on to make his WRC2 debut at the season opener in Monte Carlo than he found himself testing a full specification i20 World Rally car. Solberg preparing to rub tyres with the sport's finest after getting a surprise early call-up to the full WRC for the Arctic Rally. Even a surprise for me, I can tell you. You know, this was not part of the plan. And then uh, all of a sudden uh, they told me, you know, in Monte Carlo that, uh, you know, why not uh, just jump into WRC, you know, and uh, just give it a go in Arctic, you know, just to get experience, learn a car and just to, to get to uh, get to drive, you know. And, and, I, and I, of course, I don't say no. <laughs> Solberg grabbing his chance with both hands and on the back of that podium in the Lapland National Rally in January, the 19-year-old knows what to expect. It's an advantage to have been there, at least you know how it looks and I don't think the roads are the same, but at least you have been, been there, you know what's going to happen, you know what to expect and of course the car is very different, but uh, you know I love the snow, I love the surface and uh, as Adamo said, that, you know, I'm just there to learn and get experience and, and have a big smile on my face, and I definitely do. A big smile as Jan Solberg continues his rally education with the ultimate aim of emulating dad and mentor 2003 world champion Petter. Uh, yeah, he's excited, you know, he, he thought it maybe was a bit early, but, uh, you know, Adamo was joking around, you know, when they asked him about Kenya 99, you know, he, he didn't say no either. So for sure, I will mean, not say no. So it's just, uh, he's excited. For sure, it's a, it's a huge step, uh, especially our dynamics and, and uh, active diffs and uh, paddle shifts and have a uh, hundred horsepower more. So for sure, it's going to be a big challenge. But, you know, I think the biggest challenge will be the aerodynamics to, to properly understand them and how much more speed you can actually have. And especially in Finland, where the high speed is. I'm just, you know, just very excited. I, I love power. I, uh, I love fast cars and for sure it's, it's just a, a big kick, you know, and uh, just to be able to drive these amazing machines will just be incredible. And uh, for sure it's, uh, I'm a little bit nervous just to see how big the step is, but for sure I'm just looking forward to it. Watch WRC Plus on all devices. WRC Plus, all live.